there's one thing Regan is known for with Foster Design, it's stairs. And the stairs on this project is one of a kind. And we want to go through and peel back some of the layers from the base of the glue lamb to the stair treads to bullet holes to where did this wood come from? Tell us the story, Regan. Okay, so there were, I think there were two main things I really wanted to focus on with the stairs. One was I wanted the stairs on this first landing to look like a solid piece of wood. And then the second part of the stairs to be some sort of um, floating staircase. So no yeah. stringer, no structural piece that you could see. So it'd be floating treads. So the first part we kind of, we made out of, um, it's called PSL. It, people use it as like a, a structural beam in homes or in any type of building construction. And I, I always love the, the grain, the, the look of the PSL. So I kind of made it as this, as this landing to be this like solid piece of, of wood. And then it transitions into this staircase that, or the, uh, the second part of the staircase that it's all floating. So there's no stringer, it just comes off the wall. And then most of the structure is coming from all the spindles we had to have for code. And then up top, we have all the treads for the catwalk. Uh, I, I have a friend who has a tree trimming business and he cut down this huge catalpa tree. It's probably three feet wide. And I ended up, I bought this chainsaw adapter and I had a buddy go out and we just, we milled this catalpa tree for five solid days. He was out with a chainsaw eight hours a day milling this catalpa and we got bullet holes in it with some of the lead casing and... Um, Took out a few chainsaw blades? Yeah. <laughs> we had to sharpen all day. And so that's kind of what our catwalk is made out of, is this catalpa. It's about two inch thick slabs. And, and it's such a difference in today's building practices than traditionally stairs were kind of just a thing to get you somewhere. And it's really becoming a work of art and it, they're becoming a showcase on, the, on projects. Uh, but you definitely have to know what you're doing because I seeing this where these are just floating like this, there's a lot of structure inside of that and the beams uh, as far as blending that engineering into beauty, right? And it's definitely knowing what you're doing. So it's an honor for us to have everyone come in and see these stairs. What you do here is not about cheapest and fastest, but the passion and, and what's gonna come out of it is one of a kind. So I commend you for taking the time and doing that. So let's go look at the entry door that is built out of a shipping container door.